want to know how to minimize your chances of getting arrested for a DUI after being pulled over late at night after coming home from a bar? There are four things that you can do to minimize the chances that you'll get arrested for DUI. Hi, I'm Bill Umanski, a lawman. It's late at night, you've been out with your friends celebrating a promotion, maybe an engagement, just having a good old time, you get in your car, you think you're pretty good, you think you're sober, you're not impaired. You start driving home to get home to the house, to the family, to the friends, or by yourself, whatever, and then you get pulled over. You have no idea why, but you see the lights behind you and the siren, and you start getting nervous. Well, there are things that you can do to minimize the chance of getting arrested. I'm about to tell you the four of them that you should do, and never forget these things when you're out. One. Make sure you have your license in your hand. But by the time that cop rolls up to the window, that license is ready to go. Why? If that cop is gonna ask you for your license and you start reaching into your wallet, it may be you're nervous and your fingers, and you may drop the license. Well, that cop's gonna think automatically you're drinking or drugs or impaired. And he's gonna notate that in his report if it later comes down to him arresting you for a DUI. Have that license ready to go, he can't make that observation. The second thing you should do is make sure you have your insurance card and registration handy for the police officer. Have it out right with the license. Why? If you're reaching into a glove box and you're trying to get those documents and you're maybe sloppy or not organized and you start rifling through papers, cop's gonna notate that. He or she's gonna say, wow, suspect, that's you. Yes, I hate to tell you, you were speeding or whatever, but now you're a suspect for DUI automatically because you didn't have your license in hand and now you're rifling through your papers to get it. He thinks you're a sloppy drunk. Make sure you have your driver's license insurance card as well as that license in your hand. A good trick is having a portfolio. We give them out here actually, and you can call me if you want one. And you have your driver's license and registration in there so you can quickly get it out of that glove box as soon as you pull over and see those lights behind you. Third thing, as soon as that cop is behind you and before he even rolls up on you, roll down your window. Why? If you've been drinking and you roll down that window when the cop comes up, I can guarantee you he or she is going to say they smell the odor of alcohol wafting from the window. You roll down that window immediately and that air dissipates, the odor of alcohol comes down and there's a chance that cop may not get that overwhelming smell of alcohol that could potentially be coming from you even if you haven't had a lot to drink. Roll down that window. And four, please be polite. Don't tell the cop to fuck off. Don't challenge the cop as to why you got pulled over. Please don't be rude. So to recap, there's four things that you need to do. Have that license ready, insurance and registration ready as well. Three, have that window rolled down immediately before that cop comes to, uh, over to your window yourself and be polite. Those four things and you'll minimize your chances of getting arrested for a DUI. Thank you for listening. You got any other questions, you call the lawman 407-228-3838. Lawman out.